And what an incredible feeling there. Jared uh, uh, Bowen, of course, watched some strikeouts speaking there with uh, the manager, David Moyes, expressing their joy at winning uh, their first trophy in four to three years. Yumo Asanga joins me live at this moment to uh, do a preview. Uh, I beg your pardon, a review of uh, the game. Yumo, very pleased to see you this afternoon. Good afternoon, Ike. Yes, uh, well, West Ham United finally in four to three years lift their first trophy. The feeling must be very incredible, isn't it? Of course, it was an incredible feeling. It was an audition for both coaches. Uh, Emiliano, the coach of uh, Florentina, wanted to do more bigger things leaving Florentina. Then there were reports already before this game that uh, David Moyes might be sacked if he doesn't win this game. So this game for him was an audition. He needed to prove a point that he's a good coach. So he just managed to make sure that he sacks very deep. If you see the, the David Moyes, they play a very pragmatic type of football. It starts very deep, and what they did was, when they got that first goal, they tried to come. That was the end of the game. Well, Imo, you remember full well that this was a, I beg your pardon, West Ham United, almost at the brink of uh, relegation, and now eventually they are on top of uh, European football, <clears throat> uh, talking about the Europa Conference League. At what point do you think that they turned it around? What was the turning point you know, for you? Of course, when David Moyes came to this club, they've been doing very well. Last season, too, they did, they did very well in the Europe. Yeah, Iman, very quickly as well. Uh, what does this win do to Moyes' um, you know, reputation as far as uh, you know, European football uh, is concerned? Of course, he's David Moyes. Uh, all right, Iman. Uh, many thanks indeed for sharing your thoughts with us. Uh, well,